Is this something that's been happening frequently for you? Yeah, that, that kind of keeps happening. Okay. Well, what's going on out there? Sir, I need this to do work on you. Oh. Excuse me. Oh, hello. I heard you have a new patient. He's been a little bit of a troublemaker for us. I'll take it from here. What's going on everyone? It's Papa Jake and we are back with a brand new video and today is day number three here in Box Fort City. If you guys have been following along, we have been living in a city completely built out of boxes. Every time one of these videos gets 20,000 likes, we survive another day. But things have not gone as planned so far. We've encountered some pretty weird people and things have been happening in the city that are making us question it a little bit. As you guys can see right now, we have uh, the box for bank where we've met the friendly banker. We've got the police station that we got fired from. We've got our hospital, which we saved a couple lives. And of course the general store where we can buy anything we want for our city, like add-ons to our box for house, tape, anything we need to construct stuff. Oh, and it looks like Logan is just waking up. But guys, as you know, there are three rules in Boxford City that have been set by the mayor. No junk food. Two, no one's allowed out past 10 p.m. And three, no one can leave Boxford City. Not only that, but we've been hearing weird things going on at night. And yesterday in the hospital, when one of the neighbors showed up, he was showing some extremely weird signs and the mayor took him away. That's why today I think we need to get to the bottom of what is truly going on in Boxford City. Jake, what we need is a new house. I can't keep sleeping over there. It's too small. All we have right now is this old neighbor's house, okay? This is all we got until we can build our own house. I need a proper house, Jake. More importantly, Logan, the neighbor who was taken away from the hospital yesterday left us this. And guys, it is a safe. Now, I've been trying a bunch of different combinations like one, two, three, three, two, one, and of course, one, one, one but none of them have been working. If he was holding on to this with his dear life while we were trying to treat him in the hospital, there must be something important in here. And I think it has something to do with the mayor or else why would she take him away? A lot of you guys in the comments have been saying we need to go check out the mayor's office cause she looks suspicious, which I agree, Jake. We need to go do some snooping in her office. The only way to get to her office though would be to have a meeting with the mayor. So I have an idea. Seeing as how we failed as police officers and we kind of failed as a hospital. I mean, you weren't the greatest doctor. Uh, I mean, I, I was a pretty good doctor. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I, I might have accidentally cut that guy's hand off. Uh, ah! But Logan, that's that's besides the point, okay? We need a new venture that we need the mayor to sign off on so we can get inside her office. What's something that every city needs? A library for books? No, Logan, not a library for books. A roller coaster. A roller coaster with an arcade. Every single city on earth has a roller coaster. So why don't we go and pitch the mayor an amazing idea? We'll tell her we will build her a box fort roller coaster. How are we gonna build a box fort roller coaster we're, with loop de loops? We're gonna make it work, Logan, and the loop de loops are gonna work. And we will tell her that it will attract more people to the city because it seems like her biggest thing is getting people in the city and not letting them leave. Oh, it's you two. Oh, what a wonderful day here in Boxport City. I was just meeting with the sheriff and I thought I'd come by and say hi. I heard you had an idea or something. How did you hear that? Yeah. Oh, I just assumed so because you're always up to something in Boxport City. <laughs> Uh, I, I think our idea would be way better explained in your office. Why, why don't we head on over there? I mean, your legs must be tired from walking around all day. All oh, these babies have been with me for a hundred years. They'll keep me up today. No, no, I, I really think this is best done in the office. I mean, we should have a PowerPoint presentation, uh, to discuss it. You know, wh why don't we just head on over to your office? We'll have some snacks. We can explain it all there. Healthy snacks. Oh, no, that's quite all right. We can discuss it here. Well, okay. Well, we were thinking that, you know, to get more people into Box for City, it needs something fun. So we thought, how cool would it be to make a box fort roller coaster slash arcade slash amusement park? There you go. Oh, roller coaster. <laughs> that sounds quite nice. Yes, it would be a nice attraction to the city. Okay. Uh, I suppose I can sign off on that. Oh, oh okay, perfect. We'll, we'll, we'll start building it right now. Well, maybe when it's all said and done, you can come to my office. And if you do well, you two might be in for a promotion. <laughs> oh, bye now. All right, guys, well, it looks like...
Okay, now that she's gone, guys, it looks like she's not gonna let us into her office that easy, but she did say if we are able to build this and do a good job, she might let us in for a promotion, whatever that means. In the meantime, though, I think we do need to start building this arcade and the roller coaster. I was gonna say, though, Logan, whatever this book is, I think it's pretty important, and I don't think we should leave it out in the open. Remember the bank manager said that if we have anything valuable, we can store it in his super top secret safes in the back? Why don't we head to the bank and leave this in there, and then we can start working on the arcade. Let's head inside and put this away. Hello? Anyone here? Where's the bank manager? I don't know. Bank man, we gotta, we wanna make a deposit. We wanna put something in your secure safes. Uh, Jake, I just remembered. We also own 50% of what we made from the hospital. Oh, you're right, maybe we don't wanna see him. Okay, well you said the safes are just back there. I mean, maybe we just go back there and pick one. Yeah, yeah, I got the package. All right, I'm locking it up now. You're gonna be transferring me the money for this, right? Okay, all right. Thank you, man. Okay, bye. Man with her secret plans. Always needed me to do the dirty work. Hey! Where are you uh, doing? No, no, no. We, we, we were just, uh, we, we didn't see anyone at the front, so we came back here uh, trying to de deposit something in one of your safes. This is private property. You want to deposit something in my bank, you talk to me in the front and you pay for it up front. And you two owe me money. Uh, yeah, no, no, uh, we, we know, and we, we, we have your money. We were just, uh, sorry, sir, we didn't mean to, to intrude. Uh, we, we just wanted to put away this book. It's really special to us. That book there? Uh... Like, where did you get that? Oh, uh, this? We just found it on the ground. It's no big deal. All right, uh, I think we'll go now. Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll see you later. We'll, we'll get your money, bye. Hey, yeah, we got a problem. Oh, dude, this is getting weird. This is getting way too weird. We need to hide this book, Jake. Yeah, for sure. I mean, what was he doing there? And why was he talking to the mayor? What was on that piece of paper he was putting away? He's hiding something for the mayor. Yeah, and when he saw this book, he knew what it was. He knew exactly what it was, and he wanted to get it from us. We need to hide this thing, guys. And we need to figure out how to get in it before they do. Jake, maybe we can hide it somewhere here. Uh, yeah, we'll use the neighbor's stash area to hide it for now. Whatever was in those documents might help us figure out what's going on here. If you have any idea of the code that he put in that safe, maybe we can break back in and steal those documents. Hey guys, take a close look at this clip. Comment down below if you see what the code is. Yeah, hopefully we'll be able to figure this out. But dude, we don't want to bring any more attention to ourselves. I say we just continue with the plan, we make our arcade, we make our roller coaster, and keep everyone happy. Okay, so we're gonna take the leftover money we have from the hospital, which isn't that much, plus we owe the bank guy some money, and we're gonna go build the arcade. I think it's at this point I say my catchphrase. Let's get built. All right, guys, welcome to the Box Fort Amusement Park. We've been putting in a ton of work to make our very first real working roller coaster. Not only that, guys, but we also created the Box Fort Arcade where you can go in, play arcade games, win tickets, and even win some amazing prizes. I think altogether we're gonna attract a ton of people to Box Fort City. Now, before we show you guys the roller coaster, which you can see a little bit of, uh, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna spoil it, but let's just say the roller coaster goes around there all the way up there there's a pretty big drop in fact i'm a little bit scared to ride it so i thought before we go to the roller coaster and try that out why don't we start in the brand new boxford arcade so welcome inside the boxford arcade we got our prizes here that you can win from stuffed animals to airplanes to even little mr Pooh over here over there we've got a claw machine we even have a bubble gum machine which the mayor did sign off on it said bubble gum is not junk food because you don't swallow it and we have a popcorn machine which oddly enough she also signed off on because it's organic jake it's organic That's popcorn it is organic popcorn and then behind you logan we've got a dart game which is kind of really easy because you only have to go back here but if you hit all the darts you win a prize all right guys let's start with the claw machine oh dude the claw machine is sick it's actually really hard okay it's starting dude, the claw machine is sick it's actually probably the hardest game here honestly i'll be surprised if we're able to get something oh oh looks like he's trying to grab something so close. Oh, Come on! Running out of time! How are you gonna go in down? Has to go down? Oh. oh, you might get two! Dude, you haven't even attempted to. Oh, you're out of time. Watch how Pro gets a prize from the Box Fort City Arcade. Open up, come down, grab. Oh, come on, wait, wait, wait. No, come on! Man, not so easy as it looks, Jake. No, I got. Oh, I got it! Oh, no, no, no! Easy does it, easy does it! Oh, no, no! I hit the wrong button. I hit the wrong button. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Grab it! No! Come on, come on, come on, we're almost out of time! Drop it! Oh! 
just in the nick of time. Let's see what I got. This better be an awesome prize. It is a little chicken. Yeah, and it's squishy. Everyone say hello to Peep Peep. He's my new best friend that's gonna live in my pocket forever. That was actually a lot of fun. Next up, we have a bubble gum machine. <sighs> All right, Logan, one bubble gum for you. Here you go, but I want a gumball too. We flip the thing. Ooh, there we go. Oh, you got a gumball. I want a gumball. Oh, it works. I got a gumball too. Ah, it really still gumball. All right, well, why don't we make some popcorn? Because no arcade is complete without a little bit of popcorn. All right, guys, well, while the popcorn is heating up and getting ready to cook, I thought we'd go over to the next game in the arcade, which is the dart game. Think I got what it takes, Logan? I mean, you're standing pretty close. Right? Yeah, that is true. Okay, well, let's uh, let's go out of here. I mean, yeah, there is a chance it could mess up. First dart, here we go. Second dart, third dart. Three, two, one. Oh! And it looks like I get a prize. When the tickets are coming out, look at this, dude. I'm raking in the tickets here at the Boxport Arcade. What are you gonna choose? Uh, all right, well, you know what? Uh, I do love all these stuffed animals, and I definitely love the little llama here, but I actually was looking at these gliders, dude. I thought this could be pretty cool to try out. Before we go on the roller coaster, I did want to try out the prize I won. Jake, are, are you delaying from the roller coaster? I know you're scared of roller coasters. Yes, okay, because I'm a little bit afraid of roller coasters. But check this thing out. Ready? Three, two, one. Woo! Oh! Did I forget to mention, guys, that we actually sell that along with all of the cool stuff that we use in our videos in the official Papa Jake store. If you guys have not checked it out yet, I definitely recommend you go over there. We've got stuff to make your box for, including a box for building kit. We got LED lights, MREs, everything you could possibly want. Night vision goggles, even Nerf blasters, guys. And if you use code CITY for the series, you get 10% off your order. So go check it out. Link is in the description. All right, guys, we got to go check out the roller coaster. The box for roller coaster is all set up. I mean, I mean, I guess it's kind of like a slide. You just you just jump down there and go down there. I, no one no one's tested it out though. I, I, Jake, do you think this is safe? Uh, look, it's hundred percent safe. Don't worry. Boxport Engineering is on point on this one. Oh, hey there. Uh, hi, hi there. What's your name? Schmickle. Trying to go to Boxport City. I heard about the roller coaster. Yeah, the, the roller coaster takes you to Boxport City. Oh, I love roller coasters. Do I just jump on? Yep, yeah, you just jump down the roller coaster. Here we go! Whoa! Dude, that was sweet! I wanna try! Here we go! Woohoo! Oh, 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 that was awesome! Three, two, one! Oh, dude, that thing is so fast. Definitely do not try that at home. That thing is extremely fast and arguably a little dangerous. I loved it. Smickle loved it. But now we are outside the entrance to Boxford City and the roller coaster does not stop here. Now, of course, we need to give our tickets so we can get back inside the city and I get on the- Oh, you got a ticket? All right, we'll hand it over to the ticket guy. And now this secure entrance to Boxford City slides open, allowing us to go in and get to the next part of the roller coaster. All right, Schmickle, we'll see you on the other side. See you around. And just like that, we have another person in Boxford City. Arguably, Logan, we don't want to be putting people in Boxford City because we still don't know what's going on in here. But regardless, this is our way into the mayor's office, Jake. Yes. Yeah, okay. We Some sacrifices need to be made. But we still do have the rest of the awesome roller coaster, so... Why don't we head on into Boxford City and check out the rest of this thing? So once you come through the Boxford City door, you find the next part of the roller coaster. All right, Logan, why don't you get in and try it out? And first things first, we're going through the Tunnel of Light. Okay, let's try that again. Into the Tunnel of Light. Here we go. Woo! Here we go. Woo! All right, and we are through the Tunnel of Lights into the next section of the roller coaster. So now I would have been on the roller coaster, but at this part, Logan, you turn around and you go through Lego City, in which case you will then stop for the next challenge. And here we go through Lego City. All right, and you stop in front of the final challenge, which is a Nerf balloon pop. There is six balloons set up. You are in the roller coaster. Now you have to use the Nerf blaster to take out as many as you can. One down. Ooh, two balloons. Oh, we missed. Let's see if he can finish off the last three balloons. Oh, you almost got a double there. Oh, you're so close. Oh, one more balloon left. Hey, you want to finish it off? All right, I want to try this. The final shot. Can I do it? Ooh, all right, all right. 
All right, the final shot. Here we go. Oh, and all the balloons. Bullseye. As you guys know, we saw the bank manager put something in that safe, and he really wants the book that we have, which means that must be pretty important to him. Logan, I'm thinking that maybe in order to figure out truly what's going on, why there's a 10 p.m. curfew, why the mayor's been acting so strange, and more importantly, why no one can leave Box for City, we need to break into that bank steal what's ever in that safe. Jake, how are we gonna break into the bank? Logan, I've broken into many banks before. I've also broken out of many things before. Breaking out is a lot like breaking in and vice versa. We break into the bank, we break into the safe, hopefully one of you guys saw the combination code, and then we steal what's ever in there. We find out what's going on here and we put this all to rest. Oh, Jake, look, it's Smickle. Oh, oh Smickle, oh, stop oh, Smickle, you gotta stop oh. I wish I'd put a breaking system in it. Uh, I'm okay, I just- I What is going on out here? Somebody hurt themselves on your roller coaster? Unacceptable, Boxford City is about safety. Are you okay, young man? Yeah, I can move. How could you hurt such a great specimen? I mean, person. Person, how could you hurt a person like this? Tear this roller coaster down. You can keep your arcade, but do something else. You two are on thin ice. Yeah, oh, oh, okay, we'll, 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 we'll tear down the whole roller coaster. We'll do something completely else. We really didn't want anyone to get hurt, and I mean, we still want that promotion. We'll come up with some other idea, we promise. Logan, can I talk to you in the arcade for a second? Are we playing with the claw machine? Oh, Logan, we're not playing with the claw machine. Did you not hear the mayor? Specimen? What is she talking about? I know, I heard that. That sounded weird. This is just more proof we need to get to the bottom of this. Guys, I say we do break into that bank and we figure out what is in that safe. But in the meantime, we're still gonna have to play along. If you guys have any ideas what we should build next and add on to Box Fort City, be sure to comment it down below. Also guys, don't forget to join the squad. All you gotta do is subscribe, hit the bell button, and comment hashtag squad. And also guys, massive shout out to Chloe. Chloe, thank you so very much for being a member of the squad. If you see her down below, guys, be sure to give her a big thumbs up, leave a comment. And of course, if you want to shout out at the end of one of our videos, all you got to do is join the squad. All right, well, for now, we're going to have to lay low in the arcade. But guys, of course, this has been Papa Jake and Logan. We'll see you guys next time for another awesome video.